Hello and welcome back. As you know the autofill is very useful when we use in Excel worksheets. For example, if you input custom terms in a cell and autofill, only the defined will be copied along the correspondence cells. However, if you put month or weekday and fill automatically, it will change the automatically to the defined month or weekdays. In this lesson, we will learn how to create your own autofill pattern using advanced setting option in Excel. Here, if I execute the autofill option for the grading system, the predefined grading pattern is created automatically filled when I use autofill option. Creating an own autofill list is very simple. First go to File tab, and go to Option. From the Excel option window, click Advanced Option. Scroll down to the bottom, then choose Edit Customer List under General Option. If you look closely at the list, you can see the month and the days you are familiar, which is pre entered. To add our own autofill list, it can be done in two ways. Either you can directly input the list you want here, or you can import from the cell ranges. First, we will use Direct Entry option. For this, Select New List option from the top, and I will input the grading pattern. Like, excellent, very good, good, average, and poor. The second option is to import the list from the cell ranges. Now we will use the second option to import the list from the cell ranges. I will delete the previous custom list. Click the small arrow button here. Then select the cell ranges that you want to input. Press enter to return. And press import. And press OK button to close the window. Now the custom autofill list is generated already. Now if you may enter any item between from the grading pattern. It will follow the rest of the predefined autofill items, and it will be repeated until you stop the autofill task. However, this custom autofill list can be used only in the registered PCs. It will not work for others' PCs if you share this file. If you have additional questions, please leave a comment. I hope this video was useful one for you. Thank you for watching, and if you find this tutorial useful, please hit the like button and subscribe to my channel for more useful Excel tutorial. I will see in the next video.